This is the Mutual Audio Drama Network. The following audio drama is rated G for general audiences. The Commons. A landscape free for the ideas, sketches, and correspondence of the listeners and creators of the Mutual Audio Network. You are invited to a realm of audio drama where one moment can seem like an eternity. It's previously on. Previously on, previously on. We journeyed with Newton Fenderbender, whose feeling of insignificance drove him to learn more about his ancestry. Unfortunately, he had no help from his family, who all seemed to show absolutely no interest in the past. But Newton persevered. With the help of a few online resources, public libraries, and the Church of Latter-day Saints, he yielded a bounty of amazing information tracing the Fenderbenders back through history. He learned that a recent branch of his family had been instrumental in the Detroit auto industry. He found he was related to several minor Danish royals, as opposed to several royal Danishes. He found a link to a headless French court. It was revolutionary. The cream of the crop was an inoffensive milkman from Riverton, New Jersey, who strangely was related to a lot of random people. But that may be another story. Finally, and most recently, he confirmed a link to the infamous Genghis Khan, founder and first Khan and emperor of the Mongol Empire of 10th century Asia. The resemblance was uncanny. He was about to compile his findings with pictures of some of his relatives into an intricate PowerPoint presentation when his daughter walked into his study. Hi, hey Dad. What you doing? Oh, uh... Just looking up our family tree. Who's that? Oh, uh, that's your great 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 grandfather. Do I look like him? No, silly. You're a girl. And you're adopted. But you are too! What? That's impossible. Grandma told me. You're lying! Ask her! <laughs> My whole life has been a lie. It's okay, Dad. Rover's adopted too. But this is not the end, but only the beginning. Because Newton decides to get some genetic testing. Because I can't trust any of my family. At least my genes won't lie. No, they probably won't. Probably? That's next time on Previously On. This episode of Previously On was written and produced by Rich Froelich, voiced by Brian Douglas, and featured the voice talents of Richard Froelich and Serenity Johnson who is actually adopted. Yeah, I am adopted. <laughs> Theme and underscore license from Storyblocks Audio. This episode is a co-production of the Mutual Audio Drama Network and the Texas Radio Theater Company in association with RF Media. For more daily helpings of modern audio drama, please check out mutualaudiodramanetwork.com. Thanks for listening, and remember to watch more audio. The Commons is a free service and opportunity to share with you. To add your voice to the Commons, send an MP3 or WAV file to mutualaudio at gmail.com. That's mutualaudio at gmail.com. M U T U A L A U D I O at gmail.com. We love your feedback about anything on Mutual and are thrilled to share your ideas your thoughts, or skits in our forum. See you next time in the comments. Buongiorno. I am Flaudio. And I am very interested in what makes audio drama work. I want to share with you my recipe for a perfect evening. An evening for two lovers. Lovers of audio drama. When I plan an audio drama, I want to make sure that everything is perfect for us. 
The soundscape is the most important thing to set the mood for the night. When I lay in a special ambiance or sound effect, it is very important because it can express what I feel so perfectly. A sound effect can speak for the story when words just cannot capture the love I feel. Love I feel for you. When it is dark, I turn on the sound effects. I turn up the soundscape. And the voices can then dance in a perfect state of bliss, where there is no world except the one we make with our love. No time except what is needed for our story to play out. A story that we will make come true. This audio drama public service announcement was brought to you by The Amigos. The Mutual Audio Network. Listening and imagining together.